So the Ram brand has a long history of performance vehicles, um, bringing out the cutting edge technology when it comes to making a performance truck. The first truck was the 64 Custom Sports Special. The engineers took a 426 Street Wedge, put it in a half ton truck. All of a sudden, you had a truck that had 200 more horsepower than any other truck in the country. Uh, there's only 50 of these made, so they're super rare, um, but they're very important to our history. The next performance vehicle that came out was the 1978 with the Little Red Express. This was an amazing vehicle. The engineers figured out that catalytic converters weren't required on trucks yet. So they put the 360 cubic inch police engine in this truck, put some amazing stacks on the back behind the cab. They were all red. And in 1978, Car and Driver Magazine tested this truck and it was the fastest production vehicle in the United States that year, outperforming Corvettes and all the other performance vehicles. Real performance came back to the Ram brand in 2004 with the introduction of the SRT-10. This was a truck that they took the Viper engine and put it in a, in a pickup truck, V10, 8.3 liter, producing 500 horsepower. They also did a lot of wind tunnel work to make the truck more aerodynamic. And you knew it was a fast truck when they put a spoiler on the back that was actually functional. This truck set the Guinness Book World Records uh, speed record at the Chelsea Proving Grounds, topping 154 miles an hour. The Ram brands had a long history of performance trucks, and that continues with the Ram 1500 TRX that's coming out soon.